Hey guys, welcome to Fur Tutorials. So guys, today I create new style of water text animation in Cinema 4D. Guys, I'm using RealFlow plugin. It's third party plugin. Right? Okay, now I take more text. And guys, this time I type only A letter. Guys, you can type anything. I type A and take middle. And I change font. Font I use. Arial black. I like this font and depth I take 50 centimeter. Right? Okay. Now I go to caps and start caps take fillet and cap take fillet and radius I take 3 and radius take 3. Guys, tap I use 5 and 5. Right? Guys, go to display, select God shading lines. Yes. And you can change type, take quad angles and regular grid check. And batch size, I take 5 centimeter. Yeah. And I go to object and guys, you can increase subdivision like 10. Yeah. And intermediate points, I use subdivided. Yes. That's it, guys. See, that's my text. Okay. Now, guys, I take this time cube and change cube size decrease i take like 5 cm y axis and all take size 1000 and last one 1000 yeah at attach on flow yes right guys that's my composition okay and now guys this time I apply real flow plugin. So I go to here and take screen. Yes. And guys, again, this time I take square. This one. So go to emitter and use square. Yeah. And see, guys, that's my square. And change size. Actually, change also position. Go to inmate. Yes. And change size so go I go to object and size decrease like randomly like 40 and depth 40 yes and go to mid yes right guys that's my square and change height position yes yeah right so guys that's not visible so Go to here, text, and right click on more text. Go to Cinema 4D tag and use display. Yeah. And guys, click on use, use first, and shading mode. I take line. Yes. See, guys, that's my lines. Right. Okay. And play. Okay. Right. So, guys, now I increase frame, like 500 is good. I take 500 frames, take full, and I go to flirt this one and display. And guys, size I take like five. Yes, right? Okay. And guys, now I apply collider tag on both object. So select this more text and right click, go to real flow tag and use collider. Yes. And guys, change friction. So friction, I take like 0 0.5 and bounce, take 1. Yes, right. And guys, same. Select this cube, this one, base, and right click, real flow tag, and use collider. And friction, 0 0.5 and bounce, this time 0 0.5. Yes. So guys, go to back and play. Yes, see. Okay, so guys, that's not looking good. Fix this animation. So stop. And guys, go to here, emitter, and I go to emission, and speed, I take like 50. Yes, 50. And guys, go to screen also. 
solver and use gpu check and go to back and play yes see guys that's animation is slow yes guys you can increase radius so go to flirt and i go to here and resolution i take like 200 yes and play see guys that's looking good okay guys also apply gravity and use gravity but guys this time gravity strength i take like only 15 actually 50 centimeter 50 and go to back and play yes great right guys that's my water animation okay so guys stop this animation stop i change some settings on gravity actually this emitter so guys go to zero frame and speed check yes guys go to 290 actually 299 and speed check and i increase one frame only i go to 300 frames and speed i take zero and check right so go to back and play guys system little bit getting slow because this is my heavy particles yeah nice see guys emitter is stop after 300 frames and guys now i apply collider settings on here so guys go to more text and click on this collider tag and guys go to 300 frames and enable collider check and same increase only one frame 301 frame and enable collider uncheck and press this animation key yes so guys same go to back and play yeah nice see guys right see that's my particles okay so guys stop now i apply mesh so real flow and use mesh tool yes and guys change all setting on mesh that's not correct so resolution i take only two and smooth i take like five yeah yes and guys thin i take 0 0.1 and go to back and play guys also change relax so relax this one i take one go to back and play yes and lastly guys that's my mesh setting right okay so stop go to screen and auto params uncheck and min substack and max i take 20 20 and main 40 and 40 yes guys now my system getting slow after this setting yes see guys that's my collider and mesh guys now little bit getting slow i already create animations so i show you my this second animation so save this project go to desktop yes so close i open my project yes so guys see that's my project so go to back and play see i create already this project so go to back and play 
yes see guys that's really cool right yeah see guys that's nice it's fixed and after 300 frames it's like a explosion effect yeah great see guys i really like this animation right it's really good and really new animation guys okay so guys that's it it's my animation so stop Guys, most important part is go to screen and go to cache and use cache check this one and cache simulation click. After cache, create renders, right? Okay, so guys, that's it. It's my new type of real flow animation tutorial is finished. So if you like my video, please share and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.